Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to be back here because I haven't been back in quite some time or done a fun fashion video. So today is the day. Today I decided to film a fashion haul with reviews since we've been living on lockdown like most of the world but currently a week ago we went on to a more stricter lockdown where all the stores except for grocery stores were closed. So the only opportunity we have to buy something fun or just I don't know just because it's through online shopping and online shopping can be great but it's not always something that we want because we don't know how things fit so this is going to be a great video to find out how everything fits and if i do recommend them or not to buy to buy or not to buy we'll see so let's get started today with H&M. Tomorrow I'll be posting and other stories. And then finally, I'll be posting about Arquette. Arquette, my favorite store. So let's get started. So here's the H&M, the pack that I have. Some of the things, three items to be exact, three, three. I took out out of the bag and those were two dresses from the Cautious collection and my favorite sweater that I can't stop wearing and everything else is still packed so let's get started the first look is gonna be this pink suit so here's the pink suit I'm gonna stand up and show you how it fits and then I'll do a quick review <laughs> So I like this suit. I love the pink color. I don't know how you feel about pink colors, but I'm really excited to wear something bright and cheerful this winter season. Um, I paired it up with this top and as well, everything will be linked below. Please excuse my assistant, but she's coming over here. Um, please also excuse my socks, but it is quite cold in my apartment and I'm wearing winter wool socks which keeps my feet nice and warm anyway back to the suit the suit is nice the only thing i have a problem with is the back of the pants they are so high waisted and they are on a elastic and it kind of bunches up a little bit but again it's not a deal breaker and i do like the suit and i love the color so i'm probably going to keep all of this now to the next item which is the knitted sweater that i'll pair with the same suit pink pants Here's the sweater. I'll show you how it fits standing up and then I'll talk about it. So I absolutely love the sweater. The material that it's made out of is polyester, acryl and wool, which isn't all that bad for 35 euros. Um, the sweater fits nicely and it's oversized. This is a size small, so you can see how big it is but i do love that about it um i love the turtleneck it keeps me warm i love this detailing right here i mean going all the way down it is beautiful um i do recommend getting it because obviously i got it and like i said i've worn it a couple of times which you can see on my instagram and i'm just in love with the sweater yes moving on to the next outfit which is the purple dress So this is the purple knitted dress that I was talking about. I really like this once I tried it on. I love the back detail as you saw. Um, it's really cute. The only thing I don't like about these kind of dresses is that you really need to like suck it all in to look, to have that perfect hourglass shape. At least that's my opinion. I mean, you can totally wear it if you feel comfortable. I, for some reason, don't always feel comfortable wearing dresses that are so tight on me. But I do love the color, um, the material is great, I believe it's made out of this clothes, I could be wrong, I'll write it down below in the description what it's made out of and as well link it for you guys to look at if you like the dress. Um, do I recommend getting it? If you like the color, if you like the fit, get it because the bag detail is amazing. I personally don't think I'm going to keep this dress just because I don't feel comfortable enough 
but I'm always willing to try on something new and this was something new for me but it didn't work out as I have hoped moving on to the next purple dress So here is the light purple dress. Um, it's definitely like a baby purple compared to the other color that I tried on. It's a satin dress, which is 100% polyester, I believe. Again, I'm not sure what it's made out of because I didn't look what it's made out of because I'm very special like that. And I can tell you right now, it is made out of 100% polyester. I was right. Anyway, back to the dress. I like the fit that it's loose and I don't like the fit because it's loose. So when you wear it without anything, it's gonna look like a nightgown. And that's not really something that we want, unless you do. Um, I don't, so for me to keep this dress, I think I have to wear a belt with it to cinch in my waist and maybe a blazer to give it that extra oomph and obviously not a pair of socks, a pair of heels that will be the best thing that will go with this dress. Um, Yes, so it all depends on you if you want to keep this dress, wear this dress, buy this dress. It all depends on if you like the fit. If you like a loose fit, cinching your waist with a belt, blazer, any kind of jacket, then definitely get this dress. Obviously, the back is kind of nice that it's a little bit open with the shoulder blades kind of giving it a little bit of oomph. I don't know, but I personally don't think I'm gonna keep this dress just because it's gonna be a lot of work. Maybe I will, maybe I don't. I'm gonna think about it a little bit because I have to try it on with the belt and the blazer to see how it fits. Um, but for now, I'm on the fence. Now, moving on to the two other last dresses that I bought. The dresses that I bought are from the Cautious Collection and they are made out of recycled waste, which is kind of cool. And what I got isn't what I what I was planning on getting, but it's the only thing that I could get because of the available sizes. The collection was sold out with le less than a day, I think, which is crazy. But let's see how the dresses fit. So I'm starting out with this green little number from the collection, and I'll show you again standing up. Please don't mind my socks. I am not taking them off, whatever you say. So. Okay, so what I love about this dress, the color. The color is everything. I love green color, my eyes are green, so this goes really nice. You can see, can you see? No? Okay, so next thing I love is this thing, this, this. What I don't like about it is that it's definitely made for girls that don't have any breast, chest, and I, let me tell you, I don't really either, but it fits so tight around the chest area. It like squeezes it in and makes it all flat. And the zipper, the zipper, it takes some work to get it all the way up and zip it up. I don't get what's happening with these companies, what they are doing, how they're making dresses, but it's simple. You need, you know, you need room. You need room. You can't just go, you know, zipping your skin in because that's how it feels like. You definitely need to put something in between the zipper and the skin, like a sock, not to zip your skin in. It's also really hard to breathe in it. And I did get my size and it's a 36. So yeah, I, I mean, let me tell you, they need to fix this whole zipper chest area situation. I don't know how girls with bigger chests fit into these things. I really don't. I don't. I'm sorry, I don't. Do I recommend this dress? It's a fun dress. It's not a dress that's for many occasions. It's a dress for like New Year's or a birthday party. It's a fun dress for one occasion for one time. But other than that, I would not wear it because there's not a lot of use for it, you know. And also this, this right here, it's like me jumping a couple of times. It's, it's gonna reveal something that I don't want. 
so yeah I'm not gonna keep this dress I might make a cute fun video with it and try it on with a pair of heels but I'm definitely gonna return it I'm sorry but H&M you really need to make dresses for women not flat chested mannequins okay thank you okay moving on to the last dress Okay, so this is the last dress. Sorry, it has dust on it, I guess, from the chair. Anyway, um, I love this dress. I love the sleeves. I love the velvet fabric. So nice. Oh, it's beautiful. Okay, problems. Again, chest area. This is not stitched in right. I mean, something is happening here. I don't know what it is, but it's not happening very well. They need to fix this whole situation happening. Um, the back, the zipper is nice. It closes in well. The only other struggle that I had with is tying this um, strings to keep the dress together from falling apart. I had issues with tying it all up. Um, the length is good. It's beautiful. Um, am I gonna keep it? I'm gonna think about it, but it's a dress that I could see myself wearing a couple of times, you know, it's not a one-time dress like the green dress. This you can wear like on a date night, you could go to the theater, you can, um, I don't know, sit at home in quarantine wearing this dress watching a movie, because why not? We have no other places to go. Um, that is all I have for the clothing from H&M. All the items that I did buy and I wanted to mention this are full price. Everything, as I said, will be linked down below. And if you like anything, just go scroll down and you'll see it all down below. Um, and yes, and I'll probably go change or just sit here editing this video in this beautiful black dress. And I'll see you soon for the next video, which is gonna be an other stories, fashion haul, try on and review. See you soon, take care and have a great day. Please like and subscribe and if you don't, still like and still subscribe. Have a great day, bye.